So let's fill out this table. How do we fill it out? Well, pi i is just the logistic of xi beta. So this guy is going to be the logistic of 0 0.5, which works out to about 0 0.62. This guy is the logistic of this, which is 0 0.52. This guy is the logistic of this, which works out to 0 0.45. And if you compute the logistic of minus 0 0.3, you get 0 0.42. So now let's get back to this function. What are we doing here? First, we're computing the absolute difference between r and pi. So essentially, the distance between this guy and this guy, this guy and this guy, and so on. So let's do that. So the absolute value of r minus pi for each of the coordinates here, well, this is going to be 0 0.38, this is going to be 0 0.52, this is going to be 0 0.45, and this is going to be 0 0.42. So the distance, between, the distance between 1 and 0 0.62 is, you know, 0 0.38. The distance between 0 and all of those guys are just those guys. Now what do we do? We say, on average, is this greater than 0 0.5? And it's going to be greater than 0 0.5 in exactly one case, which is how the, this, the value of this function is just going to be, again, 0 0.25. This is the misclassification cost.